Morning everyone. Welcome back to Arm Candy. I think it's actually afternoon now. Um, but we are back with some Aspinall of London today. This is an Aspinall of London padlock bucket bag. And you can see why it's called that. And you've got the feature padlock on the front just there. It's a really, really nice bag. I'll show you the features of it. So on the bottom, you've got four base studs. You've got this top handle, which is adjustable. So you can make that quite a bit longer actually. It goes really nice and long. Um, you've got this drawstring closure at the top here, which you can tie in a knot. And then you've got the padlock on the front there. And inside this cloche is the key for it as well. Um, inside, let me undo the bow so we can get it open nice and wide. Have a look at the inside. Inside, you have got one flat pocket on this side. And then you've got one zip pocket on this side as well. So you've got that really nice big open space inside um, and then you've got a pocket as well so you can keep your safe your precious things safe um, instead of losing it at the bottom of the bucket but i love a bucket bag they're my kind of style i really like them um, i will come back and show you the size of it so here it is on me i'm about five foot four and a uk size eight it's really nice and light as well which is nice um, all the exact measurements will be on the website so if you click the link in the description it will take you straight to this on our website where you can see all the details about it. Whilst you're there, make sure to sign up to our newsletter, have a look at all of our other bags. Um, but before you do any of that, please like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell so you get alerts when we post new videos. Um, this comes with the Aspinall of London dust bag as well. And the condition, we have said that this is in good condition throughout. So it's in a really nice condition. The reason we've called it good condition, the exterior, the main reason I've called it good is just due to the shape. Um, it's that lovely soft leather. So you can see that it kind of has that softness to it, which um, is maybe why it looks like it's got a couple of little lines in it, but there's nothing major. There's no big marks to show you. There's somewhere to the corners as well, but not much at all. And then just when you have a look at the bag in the light, you can just sort of see there is some scratch into it when you shine it to the light. But again, nothing major. And the interior, we have also called good. Um, the interior is that really nice red. There's just a couple of tiny little marks at the bottom, which is why I have called it good. Again, nothing major, as I keep saying, um, but there's just a couple of little marks so you can see that it has been used. Um, and then the hardware I have also called good. The main reason I've called the hardware good is just because there's a couple of little scratches. It's still beautiful and gold, but you can just see there is a couple of little scratches to it. And then on the buckles as well, there's a few little scratches, but nothing big. It's all sort of hairline. Um, and then on the base studs, there's somewhere to them as well. But overall, it's in a really nice condition and it's just a really beautiful style as well. So if you love this, have a look at it on our website. The link is in the description below. Go and check this out. Check out all of our other gorgeous bags and we'll see you very soon with some more arm candy.